Hey there guys, I'm RandomStuff3G and I'm here to start my brand new series on Pokemon Glades version. It is a Pokemon hacked ROM and it's based on Pokemon Emerald. It's apparently it's a very good game, however it is pretty tough and challenging and you're gonna have to train your Pokemon quite a lot at the beginning as you might die quite a few times. So this is basically one of the top 5 hacked ROMs of 2013 and a lot of my friends have told me to play it and I've decided to go for it and I decided to make it a walkthrough at the same time for you guys so without further ado let's just start playing Pokemon Glazed version And guys, you might see a bit of. Sp I might speed some things up once in a while, so um, hopefully it won't bother you too much. Um, another thing is, this game is set in the Toonard region, and Toonard backwards is actually Donut. If you put that together with the name of the actual game, it gives you Glazed Donut. So it's pretty cool, I guess. And we seem to have a brand new professor at the beginning called Professor Willow. Um, he'll basically, now, he'll basically be explaining what Pokemon is and um, for example that right there is Turtwig from the Sinnoh region. Um, basically we're going to be going on a journey now and I hope you get to catch loads and loads of Pokemon really. And he'll basically be explaining what Pokemon are uh, useful really. So for example, friendly playmates, co cooperative workers, they battle for, your, for you basically because you're their trainer um, and basically we are on a journey to find out more about Pokemon for Professor Willow and we are here to unravel Pokemon mysteries and basically aid po uh, Professor Willow in his research as much as possible. So now we come to the part where we are going to choose whether we're a boy or a girl. And this boy looks pretty cool. His sprite anyway. This girl, quite boring. She's like, yeah, I've got a Pokeball. Don't need anything else. So we will probably go with the boy. The guy with the spiky blonde hair and the goggles. So let's go with him. <coughs> My name, I'm gonna go with Joel because it's a pretty cool name. And no, that is not my real name in real life. It's his random stuff, 3G. <clears throat> so, Joel. Yes, it is. So, oh, so you must be the Joel I've heard so much about, right? <clears throat> Alright, are you ready? Your very own adventure is about to unfold. Take courage and leap into the world of Pokemon where dreams, adventure, and friendships await. Well, I'll be expecting you later. Come see me in my Pokemon lab. So our adventure begins. And we are not at home, we are somewhere in the outside world. But before we continue, I just want to say, whenever I capture a new Pokemon, would you mind leaving some suggestions of nicknames in the comments? And if you see a Pokemon which I've come across and you happen to like it, leave its name in uh, the comments and I might consider catching, uh, catching it and there's nothing here but there is a guy over here <clears throat> well, what are you doing in a place like this I wasn't expecting anyone to come I'll take you back this once and explain best I can okay don't be scared I'll make sure to get you back over safely but the trip isn't fun at all and we are in our house, I assume. This is the right place. Joel. Well, that's me, sorry. Uh, this is, but how? I'll explain later somehow. You manage. I'll explain later. Somehow, you managed to slip from your universe to mine from here. It's a good thing you appeared so close to me, or there'd be big trouble. Now that you've been there, there's nothing to stop you from slipping through again. So be careful, and, uh,. I'm, I'm sorry, I've got to go. I'll try to explain later. Bye! <clears throat> so our journey is about to unfold. 
We have a cool house here. Random clock that says seven and zero. Uh, our PC here, which has an item, which I will just take out very quickly. And let's get out of this room because it doesn't seem like much to do. Now the, our hometown is called Glenwood, and okay, these are our parents. Joel, good to see you. Your dad and I were just about to go to the store in Choco Town to get a few things. Okay, so that's probably another town. Okay, Professor Willows called earlier and also you come by his lab today. You better head over right away. It's bad manners to leave someone waiting. I love you. Make sure you stay safe. One more thing, guys. I might also just, um, I don't know, maybe speed up the battle scenes for you guys because it might get a bit boring and it's pretty slow. Now, wait, I'm guessing this would be Professor Willow's out, uh, thing? Yeah. Professor Willow's lab. There we go. Oh, forget about these people. Go straight to Professor Willow. Ah, oh, you made it. I was getting worried you wouldn't show up. I believe you just got your trainer's license yesterday. So I'm here to give you your very own Pokemon companion. This machine has five Pokeballs in it. Pick whichever you want. Make sure you choose carefully. This will be your new best friend after all. Well guys, let's choose. <clears throat> there are five uh, starters in this game. Three of them are from Sinnoh, Turtwig, Chimchar and Piplop. And then we've also got Shinx and Riolu. Um, Shinx and Riolu, well Riolu for starters is pretty rare. And Shinx just appears everywhere. So these two are pretty unique in their own way right now. Turtwig, Chimchar, and Piplup, yeah, they are rare, but I'm used to using them after playing Diamond and Pearl. So, I think I'll go with either Shinx or Rio. But Shinx is just probably the better Pokemon right now. So I'm gonna go with him. Yes, I wanna choose Shinx. And for its nickname, since I haven't got any suggestions yet, I will probably name it Howler. <clears throat> ah, you picked the Shinx. I always had a special fondness for Shinx. I'd usually give you a Pokedex, but I just gave my last one out a few days ago and haven't received any more. I have a friend called the Inventor who lives in Choco Town. I believe he has a spare Pokedex or two. Would you mind seeing him? If your Pokemon are feeling weak, feel free to talk to the aid near the healing machine. And guys, that will be it. This will be it for now guys, as I will be coming, I'll probably come back another time, probably tomorrow, and I'll post a brand new video with my Shinx and how we battle together with it. So let's just have some safe travels. Let's save right here in front of our professor who looks just like Professor Birch from the Hoenn region. And goodbye guys, see you all next time.